Okay guys, um, this is a breakdown of um, using an M32, that's your minus M32, to stream um, like live events or whatever, concerts, maybe conferences, and to OBS or Facebook, whatever. It comes in um, on the M32 stream over there, and then you obviously select your cameras or whatever, you know, OBS works. Now, what I'm doing that's different is Okay, you got your normal uh, vocalist and whatever coming in on the first five channels. This channel over here, channel six, is labeled presenter. Um, that's like if you've got uh, someone walking around with a microphone, a wireless microphone, uh, speaking to people, whatever. Uh, in my case, it's this condenser over here comes in to that channel. It's it's removed from the main mix because you don't want somebody walking around in the crowd with a. Um, coming into the main mix this is the mix return this comes off the uh, front of house and it comes in out of the auxiliary physical outputs map back into another auxiliary so you know it's a uh, getting in and out of the board comes in here now what i did is i set up um auto mixing for these three channels so when you speak here it'll automatically duck the main mix feed not to the front of house of course but that's coming into matrix over here for the live stream and this is all set up to in the routing section the matrix would set up to be feed card one and two through auxiliary five and six and, um, let me see if i can show you guys where it's all set up with um a user setting so user output five and six so that means um because uh, some of this software only recognizes a stereo input that comes here and it's independent. So front of house is mixed here. This is uh, your master for feeding both three channels auto mix with <laughs> just doing ducking for to give this channel priority. Uh, my my um, monitors are run near fields on matrix one. I always do that. So that live stream Oh, this is okay. Live stream comes in on matrix three and four, and then video feed. That's um, I use the RC outs to go to like your a video camera or whatever. Now, I do have the light and control from this section of the board, controls all this stuff here. Um, there's a camper in place, and the foot controller. I can show you this. Would allow you to switch scenes, control the light, and then all of that from that. So if I do a solo, it drops the vocals, takes the guitar up, do the returns there over here. You know it's all synced in. Um, I'm gonna show you guys the auto mix setup. It's set up like that. And if you got any questions, I'll. Let me know. Um, just ask questions. All right, this works with Facebook and whatever. No, oh, you can use the remote section. All right, you put the power, take the remote, and it brings in this section. So now this becomes like a full DMX controller. So yeah, I could get red, green, blue strobes, whatever. Um, even um, control hue, saturation, brightness. <laughs> it's pretty. It's really amazing what you could do. Um, that's pretty much it, okay?